what? Purity. So what's happening with us right now? We're being made pure by the truth. You know, all of the filth that was on us in the world is now being cast off because of this truth. As it says in the book of Ephesians, the fifth chapter, brother, you can get me the, the book of Ephesians. Where did you have before, by the way? Oh, just a, well, I had uh, John 8 and 44. Mm -hmm. It's referring to Cain, you have your father. Okay, yeah, read that. Read that now. This is John 8 and 44. Ye of your father the devil, mm -hmm. and the lust of your father will ye do. Yeah, and Yahweh Shah was speaking to those Pharisees because they were they were disobeying what he was what he was all about and what he was bringing them about. So he called them your your adversaries the devil, and really the Pharisees at the time they were set up by the Roman government. So really they were agents of the government, the agents of the Roman government. Just like how you have it right now as you stand, you have these leaders amongst our people that are supposed to lead our people. Comes to find out. They're being, they're being set up by the powers that be. Like Martin Luther King, he was set up by one of the Rockefellers. And there's a picture of Martin Luther King standing right next to one of the Rockefellers. Martin Luther King. Martin Luther King. <laughs> you know? <laughs> so, that, so that's how you, that's how it is right now. It still stands right now. Even Grandmaster Jay, Grandmaster Jay, he's all connected with, with them people over there, man. <laughs> mm, yeah. Grandmaster Jackass. Yeah, they had him. They had that that Grandmaster. Um, what's his name? Jay. Jay. They got him. Um, brother done research, and they showed him in a picture with Trump as well. Oh really? Yeah. Can't, him can't. and Trump like I, I together. Even see, I haven't seen them with the black the black Panthers, man. Mm. When I saw the black Panthers do prone that he's dead. I saw him. That's a quick little clip of him. Like, what's he doing there? Mm. Yeah, he's. he's yeah, he's just in. And, and what they also found out, even the, even the Black Panthers, they were also set up too by the, by the CIA. So you had plants within within that group. So in any group that he saw sets up, um, there's going to be plants in it. Believe you me. And even in this Black Lives bullshit, it's Black Lives Matter. Excuse my French, man. I'm trying to, you know, I want to keep it clean, you know. But even amongst the Black Lives movement, there's plants in it. There's people in there that's influencing, getting other people influenced to join their group. And then basically the people that are joined, the people that are joined to cause the confusion, right? The plants, they get paid money and and um grabbing up other groups. Yeah. Some guy exposed that man. Some guy said, uh, look, man, basically look, you know, I I, I pretty much get paid the riot. He just came out and said it, man. <laughs> you know, I mean he didn't want to say, you can see, you can see through his face, he didn't really want to bring it out. Because he was kind of like thinking to himself, man. I should have never said what I was about to say. <laughs> but this all coming out. All of these people are, are paid. Even um, what's this? What's the guy's name? The uh, the actor. Oh, John Bayoga. John Bayoga. That know, guy yeah. was acting yeah, all along, yeah, man. Yeah, come on, man. Because I was going to Peckham, right, and I was watching it, and I was just laughing through the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, I just couldn't help myself. Too corny. It was too corny. The speech was too corny. Mm -hmm. And that's so even before he started, oh, the speech yeah, yeah. was breaking down. And he had the yeah, he's crying. Like, it was corny, corny, you could do this, John. Yeah. It's <laughs> stupid, man. It's yeah. like, and he was like, you put a major emphasis. You have to preach. You have to protest peacefully. Mm. I was thinking, why are you saying that? Like someone told you to say that. Mm. And it's <laughs> my mother. She was watching it, right? And she said, oh, he's just trying to be like Martin Luther King, man. Yeah. Trying to be like another Martin Luther King, you know? But yeah, man. That's just. It's just. Yeah. You gotta be aware of the snares of the games, man. What's going on? Then he goes, he goes, oh, I don't know if I'm going to get hired for any of the movies after this. Mm. Yeah, 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 but, yeah. Uh, please, 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 please. Nah, shut up, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shut up, man. Hidden, please, Where is bro. it, man? He's such a weirdo. <laughs> 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 like, he's really begging it, bro. Yeah. Real coon. Of course. Real coon, man. He's his master. Coon sample. Don't destroy him, man. <laughs> 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 he was putting that makeup, man. That's what he wants. That's all it is, man. That's all it is. It's just... How people trim their way to get off, man. All the time, huh? Yeah, so, um, yeah, who's, I forgot who's going to be on that. Shut up for that. Yeah, what's John 8 and 44 in it? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I'll tell you what, read, read it again, because I kind of lost my trinity. John 8 and 44, ye of your father the devil, and the lust of your father will ye do. And the lust of your fathers ye will do. And that can apply to these guys that are set up. Right. These black, these so-called black leaders that are set up. Right. Which were set up by Esau anyway. They're doing the lust of their father, man. Like the Pharisees were doing. You see? They don't even realize it, bro. Yeah. They don't even see how deep it is, bro. They don't get it. Because they, because what it is with Jake, Jake just want to get paid. They want that dollar dollar bill. You know? Or the pound down here. 
So if they just sell out and just ace whatever. I want to live that lifestyle of the of the next year. But what we've got to give them is far greater, oh, man. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Any riches but brother, that could Salaki, that's the spirit, because I want to say this to you. I've been here, what, a couple of hours now? The amount of edification I've received from all you brothers. Mm -hmm. Just a couple of hours, you know. That's mm -hmm. enough to get and, you saved. Yeah, and oh, imagine God. people over in High Park now, people right, over exactly. in, um, in um, um, Waterloo, whatever, they have protests over there too. Mm -hmm. Hundreds of people, oh. right? I'm here two, three hours and the amount of things I, I've learned from you brothers. Mm -hmm. Right? And you said it's a spirit. That's a so spirit, bro. What we have to give to them. What are you going to, what are you, what I'm saying? Oh, you've got six, eight people stand up here. You could, the amount of knowledge you could gain. We have to give them the, the Shit. universe. Shit. Free of cost. Oh. Free. 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 Mm. Right, 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 what is it? Buy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Buy another. Yeah. So they're not free to receive. Yeah, yeah free to give, free to receive. Yes. Free. And you don't, you don't, you don't have to, you don't have to uh, bend over the table. You ain't got to do all of that, man. Hold on, let me say something spiritual again. And when you go to these high parks and everything, and whatever information they get there, right? People don't care about each other there. But when people come here and get their education, we feel happy yeah. that somebody's woken up to the truth. Yeah. You see yeah. what I'm saying? You feel glad. Because of the angels. They, the, they, gauges, they, the, they, the angels rejoice in heaven. Yes, Just they one person passed and this and that's it. That's how important. Thank you. Because we do it in sincerity. Yeah. Right? They, they and we fear the most high. That's how important. Fucking great to live big places. You know, you know it's ridiculous for. Huh. Yeah, go on, brother. Go on, bro. In, uh, Matthew 6 and 33. <coughs> but seek ye first the kingdom of the Father and his righteousness, mm -hmm. and all these things shall be added unto deep, you. Brother, that's, deep, what, deep. that's what that's what we're supposed to be doing. Deep. Every every Israelite is supposed to be doing that. Seek first the kingdom of the most right. high, man. All because at the end of the day, let's say you and Jake and you living good, right? And you you ride in your Lamborghinis or your Paganis or whatever car. You got out there and you living in your mansion. How long are you gonna live in that mansion? But Jake, Jake thinks that this society is gonna go on and on and on. That's but it's it, not gonna go on and on and on. It's, good. it's an end to every every single thing. You know, like the shipper says, um, this mo the most high set up of the beginning of a thing and the end of a thing. Right. That's the second issue of the ninth chapter. But Jake don't because Jake don't want to come to the truth. They don't know all of this stuff, man. And when you look at Jay Z and you look at all of these. You know, superstars amongst our people, they look miserable as sin. So even though they got all of that, they're still upset about yeah. their life. They're still upset because the reason why you the reason why you become rich is to fulfill your soul, right? Yeah. But even yet and still they don't feel fulfilled. Now now their lust is fulfilled, but their soul isn't fulfilled. And that's why, you know, we around here, we could just live our regular lives. We don't feel no kind of way, right? As long as I got as long as the most side is able to feed me every day and make sure you brothers are okay, I'm good with that. As long as I got the truth and I got my brothers around me, I'm good. I don't need anything else, man. And that's how I genuinely feel. But these shakes out here, they feel as though they gotta, they gotta get the world to fulfill themselves and, and yet and still, they're not fulfilled. They're not fulfilled. Yeah, because the, 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 the words of the Lord fulfills your soul. This truth makes you whole, man. I just uh, expound on that. Go That's on, why bro, in, 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 in the prayer, what did it say? I shall not want. Right. Mm. You're not needing yeah, yeah, exactly. need right. of anything. Oh, when you got this truth, brother. you're whole. That's yeah. it. You're not, you're, you're not wanting anything else because you're whole in this truth. Right, right. Yeah, right. Bro. I, yeah. think, I think it was King Solomon that said um, he's, he's had everything, he's seen everything, but if you don't have peace, it's all nothing. Oh, it's shit. all nothing. It's wow, all to waste. Let me Solomon. try and find that. That's, that's in um, Ecclesiastes, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Number one, yeah. chapter one. You get what I mean? But Solomon, but for Solomon to make that statement, because Solomon was was the greatest man of Israel. He was the wise man of out of all Israel. So for him to say that, how much how much pain are these other guys are feeling, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They must be feeling like crap, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Beyonce, Jay Z, you know yeah. the whole crew, man. Puff Daddy. Yeah, P Diddy. That P. Diddy. dude's miserable as sin, man. And that's why he, if you know, because he got a young look. But he's all grayed up now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got gray hairs. Right, you, you know, once see... you get gray hairs, you know, yeah. that, that's a natural thing. I ain't yeah. gonna lie, man. I, I get I get a pretty yeah. gray, you know what I'm saying? It's a, just a natural thing. But what I'm saying is these people are miserable, man. Yeah. They miserable because and they gotta be miserable because look look what Solomon was saying. A why the wise man of Israel, he made that statement. But yeah, he felt the same way. He felt he felt like that, man. You know what I'm saying? Well, he didn't feel anything because he was living in peace. But Solomon wasn't, when you read the book, when you read um, the books that Solomon wrote down, he was speaking of, he was speaking about, you know, in a similar way to subject matters where 
if he had it, like he had everything, but he still, he still counted it as vain. It's, I believe it's in Ecclesiastes, yeah, yeah, yeah. the seventh chapter. Right. I'm not really sure where it's at, but it's, it's in Ecclesiastes, it's right there. It's, it's in Ecclesiastes, it's not a Ecclesiastes, yeah, it's Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes uh, chapter two. Okay. Should I, should, I, should I bring it up? Might as well, brother, Wait. might as well. Ecclesiastes two, I said in my heart, go now, I will prove thee with mirth. Therefore, enjoy pleasure, and behold, this is also vanity. I said of laughter. Yeah, so, he, so you, you hear that? He said, pleasure and mirth, behold, it is vanity, man. So even mirthing it up is vanity. Like, you know how Jake yep. like to have fun. And it's nothing wrong with mirthing it up, but you mirth it up when it's, when it's the proper time. Right now, right. Jake is mirthing it up, and we're in captivity. Right. We're getting our ass whipped. You see what happened to George Floyd? So we shouldn't be mirthing it up at all. We should be getting serious. And, and getting into the house of water, which is this house right here. Go on, brother. I said of laughter, it is mad, and of mirth, See, what even do with it? He like laughter as being mad. Check that out. This is Solomon talking. Go on. It is mad, and of mirth, what do with it? Mm. I sought in my heart to give myself unto wine, mm. yet acquainted my heart with wisdom, mm, mm, mm. and to lay hold on folly, till I might see what was good for the sons of men. Yeah which they should do under the heaven all the days of their life. Okay. I made me great works, I built in me houses, I planted me vineyards. Yeah, this is it right here, yeah, yeah, come on, come on. I come. made me gardens and orchards and pl yeah. planted trees in them, all kind of fruits. I made me pools of water to water therewith, with the wood, and bring forth trees. Mm. I got me servants and maidens and had servants born in my house. Mm. Also, I had great possessions of great and small cattle above all that were in Jerusalem before me. Mm. I gathered me also silver, gold, peculiar treasure of kings and of provinces. I got me men singers and women singers, and alike the sons of men, the sons of men, as musical instruments that of all sorts. So I was great and increased more than all that were before me See? in Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. Read that again. So I was great and increased more than all that were before me in Jerusalem. So he was basically he was living the best life even above all of the rest of Israel, man. He was the top guy in, in his day. He was king for 40 years. He was the head guy. And he had all the riches and the resources. Mm. He had servants. He had guys that can protect mm. them, bodyguards. He had the whole thing, man. Go on, brother. Also, my wisdom remained with me. Also, his wisdom remained with him because what, what made him rich? It was all because of his wisdom. wisdom. Yeah. That, he, that he asked to the most high Yahweh. Yeah. Give me all the wisdom. And that's how he was able to get all of that. Go on, brother. And whatsoever my eyes desired, I kept not from them. Mm. I withheld not my heart from any joy, for my heart rejoiced in all my labor, and this was my portion of all my labor. Mm -hmm. When I looked on all the works that my hands had wrought, and all the labor that I had labored to do, and behold, all was vanity and vexation of spirit, Good. and there was no profit under the sun. There was no profit under Whoa. the sun. So, he, so basically the man had a, everything, he had everything. But yet and still he considered it vanity. So again I say, how in the hell do these people feel, man? Oh, trust me, bro. They must they must feel like shit. Trust because me. Because they actually sold their soul. They literally bent it over and, and took it up the rear just to get that. Yep. Solomon didn't get that. But he it's still like it is vain. Go on, bro. You know what I'm saying? So I mean that's just how it is, man. That's just how it is. It, right now, and I mean even though Solomon said that, but in the kingdom, we're going to get everything. We're going to get everything. You know what I mean? For, forever, to keep, not, but it's not for be, temporary. Bro. Yeah, can't. Like you know it. what I'm saying? But right now, as it stands, we don't need everything, man. We don't, we don't, we don't need all of that. Because Jake, Jake is trying to be, all these other Jakes, they ain't really what it is. They inspired to be like Jay-Z. They inspired to live that, that life of just luxury, where they don't have to worry about being broke or poor anymore. That's why Jake is trying to, do the rap thing because they want to escape the hood you know getting got you know getting shot down in their lights they're trying to escape that which i understand that but the only way you're going to escape all of that is by coming into this truth that's the Beautiful. only way i could go i mean i'm going to just say this right i can go to any hood in england right i can i can go to the most grudgiest hood in england ain't nobody going to touch me you know why because I'm, I'm 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 under the spirit of the most beautiful side. brother beautiful you know that hedge is that spiritual hedge Alright, bro. It's my book. I'll show you what I'm going to do. I'll show you what I'm going to do. Stay safe, man.
Yep, we've got another three uh, first Timothy six and six. Yes, mm. brother. Body, this will continue. Yeah, you're yeah, yeah, going, going, yeah. This is uh, first Timothy mm -hmm. six and six. But godliness with contentment is great gain. Mm -hmm. For we brought nothing into this world. Yeah. And it is certain we can carry nothing out. Yeah, you can carry nothing out. Because the reason why people do the things that they do is simply for gain, it's simply for getting money. But the money that's the money that people are using right now is evaluating day in that and day out. That's why if you go inside your stores, all of the goods in your stores are much more expensive as it is today. Basically, um, let me read what I'm saying. If you go inside your store, right, everything's more expensive than it was back in the past. Why is that? Because the money is going down. The value, the valuation of our currency that we use is going down. So what's really the point of trying to gather as much wealth as possible? What's really the point of making money when this world is going to come down? That's why the scripture says um, that we that we have to pray for our daily bread. Yeah. You know, so hey, brothers, man, if you if you a brother that that's live, you know that's live with your mom or whatever the case may be, don't worry about that, man. Don't worry about that because hey, the Lord is going to give you way more than, than what you than what you want. Okay, brothers is going to be in, in palaces and, and all of that, man, in the kingdom. But we just got to suffer this right here. Go on, brother. You got a precept. Uh, this is uh, Job uh, one and twenty one. And said naked. Come on. Yeah, Job 1 and 21. And said, Naked came I out of my mother's nice, womb, mm. and naked shall I return yes, thither. Exactly. The man. Lord gave and the Lord have taken take away. Right. The Lord Blessed have, be the name of the Lord. Right. The Lord have given and the Lord will take away. Okay? But the key point is we were born here with nothing. And we're going to return to the Lord with nothing. On, Can I say something, brother? Yeah, 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 go on. And it's all about the peace, as you said, right? Mm -hmm. In Ecclesiastes 25 and 13. Give me any plague, yes. but the plague of the heart. Right. You know? Because we're begging for this peace. So that's what we're working towards yeah. now, that eternal peace. Yeah? Exactly, yep. Yeah. And any wickedness, but the wickedness of a woman. And that's another. That's a lot of things we're suffering with. Yeah, because most of these women don't bring That's peace. what I'm saying. Yep. Don't bring peace. They give you more, you know? Well, you know, and the, Nate said, you, I'm because Nate was talking to the women. Yeah. And Nate was saying, man, see, what we, we want as men, you women out there is peace. Yeah. But guess what? They can't provide us with peace. Because they're all mentally disturbed. So they can't they can't That's provide it. you with peace. That's it. But the point being is, is that peace is like peace surpasses everything. Beautiful. Yeah. And yeah. we just read it. The scripture says we just read the scripture. You could have, like what Solomon said, you could have wealth and you can have all all of this beyond, right? I'm roughly paraphrasing what he was saying. I still got it. I still got okay, it. yeah, read it again, brother. Where was it? Where was it? Where was it? Yes, this is um, Ecclesiastes 2 and 11. Then I looked on all the works mm. that my hands had wrought and all on all the labor that I had labored to do. Mm -hmm. And behold, all was vanity and vexation of spirit. Yeah. And there was no prophet under the under the sun. And there was no prophet under the sun. But there was another precept. I think you was reading it. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about, right? Where it says, um, System to the effect of you could have all of the riches, but if there's no peace, yeah. then something oh, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, I was trying to find that. True. So the, the 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 key thing to to mankind is peace. It's not wealth. Um, it's it's not having a, 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 a you know a, a, you know a good charisma to attract people to you. That's not going to do it. What what? The reason why we do all of these things and we and we we want to attract wealth and we want to attract people unto us is simply so that we can feel at peace within ourselves. That's why we do all of that what we do. This is why we work hard every day to day, so that we can be we can be at peace within ourselves. Because if you don't work, you're gonna be the idea of being homeless is on is unpeaceful, right? Yeah. Beautiful. Then you become disturbed in the mind because you there's something that you need as you believe. To keep you in in a state of peace, you see. But the, the but the way to peace is through Yahweh Bar Hashem Yahushai. Yahweh Shai said, "I am the way, I am the life," and that's how, that's what it is. Go on, brother. This is John 14 and 27. Mm. Peace I leave with you. Mm -hmm. My peace mm -hmm. I give unto you, not as the world giveth, give I unto you. Mm -hmm. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Great. And what did he mean by that? The truth. Because once you know the truth, what is what is it? You are set free. free. So there's that that state of peace. So even though all of this is going on and 
helicopters been hovering around us <laughs> from the beginning. We're still at peace. Yeah, you going, brother. Uh, Cause the, that that truth is the understanding, and this is Philippians four and seven, and mm -hmm. it says, "And the peace of the Most High, which passeth all understanding." Right, which is exactly beautiful, brother. So the peace represents the wisdom, and understanding, which is this word, the scriptures, the truth. Oh. So once you have this truth, you are set free. You are no longer under the influences of this world. I got a quick one out. Go on, brother. Uh, so yes, yeah, <laughs> the word of Allah. Uh, See, brothers got each other's backs too, man. That's what the truth does. Free brotherly love. Uh, yeah. Psalms 125, 2 says, And the mountains are round about Jerusalem, so that the Lord is round about his people from henceforth forever and forever. Mm -hmm. Last one. In 5. As for such as turn aside unto their crooked ways, the Lord shall lead them forth with the mm -hmm. workers of iniquity. But peace shall be upon Israel. Mm -hmm. But peace shall be upon Israel. Why mm -hmm. would peace be upon Israel? Because of the truth. That the, the truth that was spitting out, out here. Right? This is the truth and this is the wisdom this, of peace this and, yes. and, and all of that. That's why it. peace is gonna come all, all over Israel because when Yahweh Shah makes a second return and we get we get set up again and we set up that kingdom of heaven, it's gonna be based on it's gonna be based on this right here. Which is going to bring, which is going to bring peace to our people. Oh, beautiful, go on. go on, brother. Psalms one, two, one, and four. Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. Yes. The Lord is thy keeper; the Lord is thy shade upon thy right hand. Yes. The sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. Uh huh. The Lord shall preserve thee from all evil. Yep. Yeah. He shall preserve thy soul. He shall preserve thy soul. So Simply peace. You see. And the Lord shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in yep. from this time forth and even forevermore. Exactly. So we're going to be at peace even from when, we, when we come into the earth. The two and the two thirds come back. They're going to be at peace. Like when you read the book of Deuteronomy 28 and um, all around, downwards, from, you could begin from the 15th verse. And within those verses, it tells us that cursed shall thou be when I come as then, and cursed shall thou be when I go as thou. And that's to me because we've withdrawn from the peace, which is this truth. So when one, so when the nation of Israel withdrew from the Most High, they withdrew from their peace. You see, but we're getting it all the way back again. And that's why we don't, we don't feel like we need anything else. We got it all going on internally, because it all starts and everything starts internally, and then it makes its way, it makes its way physically. You see. Still got, I still got some meat on Timothy's. Uh-huh. You're going, bro. I do. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'll tell you what, brother. You'll read some more on that. I'll get that. Some more. All right. Okay, this is, this is um, Hebrews 7. I'll start from the top. And it says, For this Melchizedek, king of Salem, priest of the most high power, mm -hmm. who met Abraham returning from the slaughter of the kings, and who blessed him, mm -hmm. to whom also Abraham gave a tenth part of all, mm -hmm. first being by interpretation king of righteousness, after and after that also king of Salem, mm -hmm. which is king of peace, without right. father or which, without mother. Which the word Salem means peace. That's why his, that's why he was known as the king of uh, peace. Salem, Salem. I'm saying, Salem means peace. Go on, brother. And it says without father or without mother and without descent, neither having beginning of days mm -hmm. nor end of life. But made like unto the son of the Most High, yep. abideth a priest continuing. Yeah, and that's um, that's Hebrews seven, right? Yeah. Yeah, that goes into um, I believe that's Melchizedek as yeah. well. Melchizedek yeah. was also Yahweh Shah, yeah. which Melchizedek means um, the King of Righteousness. Yeah, Malak <laughs> Tzedak. So there you have it right there. But he was he was that guy that um that had no that had no beginning. He didn't have no parents. So he he was uh he was a man that uh. Um, that just appeared, mm. which the Lord can do. That the Lord can make a man just, just um, what is it? Uh, materialize, okay, or materialate back back to the physical realm. He could do that, so to speak. But yeah, Ram, that's all we. That's all we're gonna bring to you, brothers, man. We're gonna close out. First and foremost, I want to give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, Bashem, Kodesh. You know, Wow, Bob, 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 Bob.